See that strut is too long, so we got the two brains working on that, and I'm just letting you guys listen in. What if we took a regular, not a ball link, but a, uh, yeah. what if we took one of these, Paul? Oh, it's going to be too long, ain't it? Well. I think we have limited. We have a limited amount of throw with that with a ball like this. See, it's got to it's got to go. Oh, a bit. See how much how far yeah. that's got to go like this, and it's got to mm -hmm. yeah. It's got to do all of that. So, this is really a good solution. Okay. Yeah. But it there is. may be a better solution out there. We just have to look for it. Where are you taking that safety wire around here? Well, it's, I'll have to see. It was I, I looped it around the inside here. And then uh, some attachment point. I don't remember. I may have to drill another hole in here to. to right, that right, 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 right. That pops okay. off. It comes off. And we don't want that. It's a nice, tight fit now, but. Uh, yeah, but stuff later. happens, It'll man. Let me draw a little picture. Got pencil and piece of paper. Oh, now you're asking for a lot. There's to put your that paper's over there on the table, on that little stand right there. You soaking all this oh. in, John? Yeah. Well, welcome to the shop, everybody. Got some special guests in the I'm shop. Artist, we got John, Same came here. down from Chicago. Okay. Brought his trusty camera, it's over there by his okay. side. Quick draw. <laughs> Taking some pictures for the website. We got Dad stopped by the shop today. We got sharp pencil. We got some minds at work here. I'm just gonna sit back and watch it, watch it happen. Yeah. <laughs> and make a ball link. 
like that, it's got a screw that comes up here. You'd have to put a slot in there. Right. Well, it goes two different ways. Dad. Well, that's why, why I'm putting a slot in there. Because this would pivot this way, this piece, because uh -huh. right. it'd be on a, a screw on there. That would pivot that away. And this, and with a nut on it, here, and a washer, you'd have to put a fairly big washer. You, it would uh, go back and forth this direction. You follow me? Not really. See, this, this would go this way. And this piece would go the other way, kind of like yeah. the U-joint. How is that different than what we got here? Well, the only, th well, the only difference is there would be a nut up here. To where Going that through the ball? Yeah. Oh, that's what you're saying. And uh, you could... Oh, I see what you mean. Yes, yeah, 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 yeah. Well, we could try that. The, the only thing is, I don't, I'm not sure how we, we would have to wind up making a socket. Right. Well, what material would you use? Why would you I have would, to, uh, why would you, why would it have to be a socket? No, why would it have to be a socket? Why couldn't this be a flat piece of metal across here with an, one coming up and put a bolt in it? That would give it this way, and then this piece would give it this way. Well, we could try it. Yeah, that's and, what I was, yeah. that's exa so, about exactly what I was talking about. Kind of so, making so a U-joint, and, and then that won't pop off. There a won't U, be no a way. Right, a little U-joint. Uh, yeah. We could try that. Absolutely. Bam, that's how it happens, people. <laughs> <laughs> Put your heads together. That's, that's two. <laughs> <laughs> Put two, them two heads together, you're liable to get fire. <laughs> Hey, look at this, people. Dad took Paul's gear home and uh, got an extra set. Actually, Dad's already got three sets of these made. They came out just awesome. So we got some extra gear already. And look at this. We got this kind of mock-up done on this gear door. That's how it's going to work. This little door open like that. If we shrink that, that's going to help this. Then this big door fastens to the strut. And it'll actually move up and down with the strut. And then this door. So three, door, three door set up. The ducks in there. Perfect fit. It's just perfect. See, all this will be glued to the wing up in here. Then it's glued around there in that bulkhead. And this is the only part that's really exposed to collapse. And uh, I just really think it'd be all right, but if you know, worst case scenario, we could wrap some of that tow. That carbon toe around there, around where that bulkhead is, and even out here. And this, remember, this is three layers of carbon. This ain't moving once we get all that laminated, man. And uh, it'll be all right. Yeah, it's going to have to be three and three quarter inch wheels. So if we go down an, uh, an inch right. with the whole bracket, that would shorten this distance. Right. And then uh, cut off a half to three quarters. Then, yeah, then this would fit. Then it would fit. That's what we've got to do. So it's, it's really not, it's not going to be hard to do. No. But I'll, I'll, uh, I'll look for a little universal. We'll see if we can try that on this was just a nice, simple solution since Lynn had worked out on the B-58. Yeah, it worked. So. Uh, you know, the other way we can get around all this is by steering it from, we could bring this through and steer from here. But with this, see how it, we can't keep this, we can't put the servo here. It's got to go on the bottom side. Mm -hmm. And we'd have to have a, a linkage that would go from here. So here, that, would, that doesn't interfere with